Hello everyone, this is Dumpster Collector here with another Marvel Legends review. Uh, and as you can see, the backdrop is a little different. Uh, I had to take down the little city that I had um, because we're trying to fix up the house. We're in cabinets where the table was and stuff. So right now I'm just using this for the review. So you'll be seeing this for the next few uh, reviews here. But um, without further ado, so here we have the cyborg spider-man figure it's a target exclusive i was able to find it um and yeah so here's the box here for you you get that retro spider-man logo there and then you get that old-fashioned marvel comics logo and then you get Spar uh, cyborg spider-man here you get that billboard that has cyborg spider-man here so that's cool uh we get the same card and stuff like that so that's cool and then here's the back. If you guys want to pause and read that, you can. You get that billboard picture again. Same logo. And then here's the UCPI for you. Uh, nothing on the sides. Nothing on the top. Nothing on the bottom. Besides that, let's crack them open. And here he is out of the packaging here. So he has two accessories here. So first, let's start off with the web here. We've seen this before. You get that little loop there for him to hold on to the web. And then you get that nice little sculpting going on there it's like a pearl white uh paint over the web here so that's cool and you get the little squiggles so yeah we've seen this before and he comes with one fist hand here so yeah we've seen this hand before the lines look good nice and clean i like the red that they use for the figure in the hands here so uh yeah they did a good job on that uh but besides that that's all we got for accessories i wish they came with wall crawling hands for both of them i wish they gave us an extra hand for the robot hand here but besides that let's go over the figure here so you get this new head sculpt that we've never seen before i like the eyes that they used for it it's nice and wide it kind of gives it maybe a mcfarland look i think but, but you also get this headband here so that's cool Get that robotic eye, nice red paint there. You get that nice gray around there. You get that little strap going around the head here too. So that's cool. I really like the, uh, the red that they used and the blue too. It's really cool. And I think the sculpt here is the Sunfire mold, I believe, for the body. So yeah, there's that. Uh, but yeah, we've seen this hand before, the swooping hand. So yeah, there's that. We got the arms. I like the lines that they used here, that they did here. They're really clean. You get this nice looking blue here. Look at, I like the spider here. That's a really cool spider. I like that a lot. And then we get the arm here. I think we've seen this hand before, but I don't know where or who has it. I like the gray here, but I think they could have added a little bit of wash just to give it a more detail, I think. But I like the sculpt here. You get that bicep things going around there so that's cool you get that little shoulder plate there so that's cool on in the back you get you can see that there's a little bit of paint, uh, paint chipping there uh the legs look a little blended in with the blue here um but yeah and then it's a little stuck here um but yeah i like the spider here it's pretty cool i just the paint looks a lot off with the legs here and you can see it's missed it a little bit. Uh, and then you get this little yellow utility belt here. I wish they could add a red right there where the buckle is. Um, yeah, and you get this little band here on the thigh. You could slip that off if you want. So yeah, there's that. I wish they had added stitching actually. Oh yeah, no. On the mold on the head here, you can, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but there's there's a little mold, I mean, not mold, uh, like they sculpted the stitching in, but they didn't paint it for some reason. There you go. You guys could see it a little bit, but they didn't paint that. They should have painted it. That would have been cool. I think they could have added a little bit more stitching throughout the figure here. That would have been cool. Uh, and then you get the feet here. Nice, clean cobwebbing here. You get that little scuffing there. It's like a little extra plastic there you get that white thing there but yeah besides that let's go over to um the articulation here so his head can move down that far up that far really far you can look left and right 
Uh, he has some hip pivoting, so that's good. Uh, his shoulders can move, well, the big one at least can move out that far. I think this one, yeah, they're about the same. So, yeah, they can just move up that far only. They have butterfly joints. This one likes to get stuck a little bit, I think. Uh, this one, same deal. They're a little stuck, but um, they're, I just took it out of the package, so it's probably going to have to get worn. So, yeah, there's that. You got bicep joint, a double jointed, uh, sorry, double jointed elbows. That's better. Um, you got wrists that hinge down that far, up that far, 360 rotation around there. Uh, I'm not sure if it's any different for this one. Double jointed elbows there. Eh, it's about the same. So, yeah, there's that. Uh, is, he has an app crunch here, so you can move forward that far backwards just a little bit he has a uh waist swivel so you can move 360 rotation around there his legs could kick out that far that's actually decent he can kick forward really far that's also good backwards just a little not a whole lot you got a thigh cut here you got double joints and knees that's really good and you got boot cuts here so that's good his ankles can hinge down that far, up that far, and nice ankle pivot. And there's that. Um, I, I I like the figure a lot. I like the. I wish they came with a little more accessories, and I wish they had a little bit more detailing. Uh, like adding a little bit of wash on the metallic arm there. I meant the robotic arm there. Um, adding more stitching throughout the figure. I don't know why they didn't paint the. A little stitch there on the head there um but besides that i like the colors i like this web sculpting a lot that that's that stuff's really clean uh the blue is awesome i love the spider that they used here uh the utility belt it's okay they could have added a little bit of red maybe for that buckle there um besides that i, I really like the figure I, I was excited to get it i am really happy i got it though um but besides that that's all i've got